To try and win over the girl of my dreams, I spontaneously broke into a French accent. <laughs> I have just... A, a preliminary question is, had you spoken to her before she heard the French accent? Yes. Um, <laughs> I, I'd been speaking to her uh, with this accent, <laughs> um, which you, you might discover is the only one I can do. We, what, what happened was, um, I was on holiday with, with my family and we were in Spain and we were staying in, like, a, a hotel. <laughs> <laughs> and um, there were two Swedish girls uh, around my age who were also staying in the, in the same hotel on holiday and I took a shine to one of them. Um, I, don't, I don't know whether I should say her name or not. I guess you could bleep it out, right? Who's that? Her, her first name is swear word. <laughs> <laughs> her first name is fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I still have a place in my heart <laughs> for a uh, cunter. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, her... <laughs> she, was call she was called Therese. And we went... Me and her went up on the roof of the hotel <gasps> together. Ooh. Yeah. Right. And for some reason, I thought I would appear to be more sophisticated <laughs> and romantic with a French accent. Did you think that she would think you were French? No, Frank, I was intoxicated <laughs> by desire. OK. And Spanish lager. I guess I thought, I, like, uh, French is like the... the um, language of love. It's the French and language is the language of love, not English spoken in a French accent. <laughs> <laughs> Which is, or, I think, what you or, did. Or even worse, Welsh spoken in a yeah. French accent. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not... I'm, I'm, uh, you have to understand, I'm not putting this forward as a good idea. No. <laughs> I'm not, I'm, not, I'm, so, I'm not recommending this. I'm yeah, not showing okay. off. What, before we even hear it in French accent, what did you say? I, no, I, so I said, I mean, I was like, um... <laughs> <laughs> this is so embarrassing. I would be like, oh, the stars, they are very beautiful tonight. <laughs> another question, another question. <laughs> was that the French accent? <laughs> 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 it sounded like Dracula. Because oh, that, like, to me, that sounded like a little bit like you'd spent a few months in India and picked <laughs> up just a little bit of that. That didn't sound terribly French. I didn't want to go full French, you know, because it's um, <laughs> cultural appropriation. <laughs> and I've got a question for you. This Swedish girl, mm. where do you reckon she was really from? <laughs> <laughs> she, she had a, a sombrero that she <laughs> never removed and a curly moustache. All right, truth or lie? Well, it seems completely plausible to me. What yeah, it feels plausible, but the fact that there's not even a trace of a French accent... <laughs> <laughs> makes he never me... said he was good at it. No. no he, he also didn't say he said... couldn't do it at all. Mm. <laughs> oh, look, I mean, I believe in love and I'm happy to go for true. Yeah. Look, I've done something similar, to be fair, yeah. in my younger years. Should we believe in love yeah. and say we true? We believe in love. <gasps> We believe in love, so we're going to say that it's true. All right, Lloyd Langford, is that a truth or a lie? It is true. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for believing in love, Team Frank.